varsity club welcome back to another classic and the coyotes have a big one today obviously week number one was a massive one for us week number two we were a little bit humbled week three is gonna be a whole lot more of getting humbled why good game brother you might be asking well the reason why we're gonna be getting humbled is we're playing number two the ohio state university it's gonna be a tough one not only is Ohio State absolutely killing it right now, but Justin Fields is also killing it. I mean, he barely played in the previous week. The man didn't have the greatest stats, but he's still the front runner for the Heisman. And we have to try to stop him today. It'll be tough. The Ohio State University. We're playing at their stadium too, which just makes it even more tough. We're going to send Miller Moody out. Okay, then. Look, our goal is to not get shut out. Really, we're trying to... <laughs> Obviously, we're trying to win. But to be realistic, we're just trying to find ways to survive. Okay, then. We had Kalen Harris pretty much open across the middle. We just couldn't get a block long enough to get in the ball. Okay, I'm crying. Shipley, scared beyond belief. Okay, thank God he didn't catch that. Quit punting. So we punted the football to basically the middle of the field. That was... There's not a lot that we do great. Punting is definitely one of the things that we don't do great. He got out of the backfield. We're missing tackles, but Edmonds does bring him down. Chris Olave is the number one receiver in the nation right now. He's leading everybody in receiving yards, so we got to try to shut him down. As well as Justin Fields, who just stiff-armed our best defender and then broke another tackle, and he's still going. Help. I'm sure there's a little sausage finger, Mervin. It's out there in the comments telling me I just learned how to tackle. A coyote's going to get you, a little Mervin. I just... We're playing on Heisman with difficult sliders. We have no shot, but we're going to try. Our first foray on offense, not great. Our first foray on defense, also one would classify as not great. Jesus Christ, Sean Wade. If Sean Wade played that good in real life, he would have went in the first round. I'm just saying. Sorry, Ohio State fans. All right, Dawkins, we're going to put you deep as a decoy. Harris, quick little out route. Christensen downs. There we go. I like those routes. Yup. I'm crying. Look, I don't think Jojo Johnson is like ready, right? But he might be the option sooner rather than later today. Oh, no. We just, I didn't even look at the route. Didn't even look at the route. I didn't even look, okay? For a second, I was like, is that Malik Hooker? But then I realized that's Marcus Hooker, who just had his first interception of the day. I'm saying first because more might be coming. Look at Nesbitt. We got a tackle. I think honestly, one of the biggest things for us right now is getting a tackle and not getting immediately thrown in the ground like a small child. Like it's it's the little things. Oh, God. Fields fumble. I think coming into a game like this, you're really just hoping for not giving up 50 points. You know, like that's our goal. Almost had it. Ha Hammond came in with a good tackle, but we we're a little bit too late on the defensive line now. Here, I was trying to get off the block. Jackson Chamberlain, don't miss. Jackson Chamberlain, like, really is a special talent, man. Like, the amount of times that dude just comes up big play after big play, you gotta love it. Oh, God. Okay, Hammond, I like that. Here's the thing. I have no idea who is behind Justin Fields or Ohio State. I know that if we can take him out, our chances of winning are still pretty much... <gasps> Chamberlain, oh my God, you picked that off. We might score the only touchdown of the game. Okay, this is the W in my book. We stopped them. They didn't get a touchdown. They're going to go for a field goal, likely here. We're going to be fine, okay? We're only down 10-0. We scored a touchdown. They're shaking in their boots. I'm going to allow J.J. Shipley to get through the first quarter, you know? Nerves. He's playing at the big house. Like, I mean, not the big house. You know what I mean? I'm sorry, Ohio State fans. You know, I didn't mean Michigan Stadium. I meant he's playing in a big stadium. I'm sorry. Okay, well, how could you call it? I'm sorry made a mistake okay i've never made a mistake in this channel before a little halfback draw action miller moody oh some ankles being broken they're blocking for your boy okay imagine if we find out ohio state's weaknesses run defense okay they've got they're kind of loaded in the left side now okay just kidding they're perfectly fine on run defense they're fine running a play action feels like a really dumb mistake here we're still doing a yolo yeah. what Huh? I was thinking maybe we throw a 50-50 ball, you know? He decided to make it a 0%. 
You know, literally no shot. I hate it here. <gasps> Punt it. Defense, this has got to be a game that you just go bananas right now. I need you to step up big. Even though we're technically not doing well in this game, we still look good, you know? Some of the best jerseys in college football. You already knew that, though. Fields makes an adjustment. Watching Master T out of the backfield. Of course, Justin Fields is keeping it. I'm trying it. <laughs> we need him a fumble. We're getting injured. Not in real life, though. Big adjustment here. Hammond's got to cover the tight end. They're going to run it, though, and they got the corner. Good hit, but Wilson picks up nine. Second is sure. Gonna move our guys around a little bit. They're making an adjustment. Bouncing the line out. Nesbitt trying to get there. Doesn't matter. I mean, they've got people everywhere. Farrell picks up five. First quarter's winding down. Ohio State trying to put some more points on the board. We're trying to say no. Oh my God. This might be the one right here. Chamberlain picks him up, but I mean, they are everywhere. Last play of the first quarter here. Fuel stays in shotgun with Teague to his left hand side. Chamberlain makes a good move, but it doesn't matter. They get rid of that one quickly. We end up getting him hit out of bounds, but it's another first down for the Ohio State University. I think what made the first quarter like even crazier is that we had <laughs> even saying it's making me want to vomit. We had three yards of total offense in the first quarter, not first drive. First quarter. I know, <laughs> I know. Fields is absolutely carving us up right now. I'm vomiting. They're laughing. I mean, the, the, the bright spot of this game is that. OK, Davis Jr., I'm sorry. The bright spot of this game is that we may play their backups in the second half and we might score some points. We'll just be down a middle aged man. This game is also for all those people in the first episode of the first game that we actually had that probably said they're not playing on a strong enough difficulty. Oh, I beg to differ. I beg to differ. Johnson in the game. In case you didn't realize that we've had enough of Jojo Shipley at the moment. Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> we might go to the third one on the depth chart. Ohio State came to play. We did not. Things that hurt. <laughs> Everything. Oh, my God. There we go. Thank you. Second and nine. Yields again. Add it again. Oh, yeah, yeah. Take him out of the game. <laughs> He's too durable. We've got a legit opportunity here. To lock him up. Okay. 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 We held him to maybe a field goal. I think if I'm Ohio State, I'm probably going for it every single time. Fourth down and 29. I'm still going for it. Why? Because we're not good. Not as good as them. No, we're close. I'd go for it every single time. <laughs> Luckily, they didn't. Last drive. We had a nice little run to start it. Went for a quick little screenplay or slant play. It did not work. Back out here. They know everything is coming. The Ohio State University up 20 nothing. Honestly, I thought it might have been worse at this point. So I'm kind of OK. No, God bless him. Pete Werner. OK, buddy, how bad can it get? I honestly, it's going to get a lot worse. I think we can't even see our receiver icons. <laughs> oh, we're down bad. Jojo Johnson, very fast. Don't fumble. God bless America. Don't fumble. You're our only chance to score right now. Oh, yo, Bradley could be the move here. Oh, Kalen Harris wide open. Let's go. Give him a block. Kalen. Kalen. Jojo Johnson for Heisman right here. How you kidding me? <laughs> We wouldn't score a touchdown. You thought wrong. The level of confidence that I'm currently feeling is none. I mean, Kalen Harris is wide open. They messed it up. They went for Bradley and proved to not really work out for them. But we got a touchdown against the Ohio State University. But good game, bro. You scored a touchdown against Michigan and ultimately beat them. <laughs> it's Michigan. They're not good. Second and 13. Oh, my God. Can we? Learn to tackle. Okay, tackling drills for everybody. Things are tough right now. Switching our guys up so we got a little bit better coverage. 31 means it's probably a run. They didn't go for the run. Rawls is back there. Oh my god, Alave! You should have known. A little over two minutes left. Ohio State's trying to get more points on the board. They're like, yo, let's get another run or two in here for our starters. <laughs> now Trey Sermon. <laughs> Everything hurts. Okay, I'm laughing because I, I want to cry. 
I don't know when. I don't know how. One day we're going to beat Ohio State in this dynasty. And it's going to be a glorious day. A day that we'll talk about forever. Look at Miller Moody. Look at him. I mean, on the bright side, the Ohio State University paid us an insane amount of money to come play them today at their stadium. So we're going to... We're not exactly down bad, you know? <laughs> okay, Troy Bradley's dead. Second down, six yards to go. The lefty holding it down right now. What? I don't think I've ever seen a stat line like JoJo Johnson's right now. He's two for five. <laughs> One touchdown, two interceptions, and like almost 100 yards. Like, I, I genuinely... I'm unsure as to what is going on in this game. Oh, look at this. You got your guy. That's one foot. Let's go. Look at that. Three for six, 102 yards, one touchdown, two interceptions. That is the craziest stat line I've ever seen. Okay, Miller Moody. Let's go, Miller Moody. Breaking tackles. You're giving him some blocks and look what's happening. Minute left. Jojo Johnson's seeing all kinds of greenery in the. Okay, slide, please. Good God. Hey, roll it down 34 7. Could we come back? No. I believe. <laughs> oh, God, thank God he went out of bounds. Everything felt great. And then Josh Proctor said, nope. Nope. I think we're getting closer to Ohio State putting in the backups, you know? I just feel like maybe it's a possibility. Realistically, though, I feel like it's probably not coming to the fourth quarter, which means they'll probably have 60 at that point. Hit Justin Fields. Hit him. Hello. Hello. Any, anyone? Are we sliding now? Also, to make matters worse, Ohio State uh, called a timeout. So they're definitely trying to <laughs> they're trying to destroy us. Okay, we're too close. We're in Akron there in Columbus. They're like, no, you guys are getting destroyed today. He went underneath Master T. We're going to bring him down in bounds. Let's go. 36 seconds left. One timeout. They got a whole lot. No shot. They're getting a touchdown. I'm dropping my guys back. I mean, the first down, probably. Oh, oh, we out here. Call a timeout. I might. Maybe we get a punt back. Honestly, I don't know why exactly we called a timeout there. It's probably because they're going to score a touchdown here. I'm going to cry. So we just gave them. Okay, 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 okay. 24 seconds left. They're about to make a strike. I can feel it. This is this is going to hurt. Oh, my God, he fell. <gasps> he fumbled. Of course, they recover it. Okay, they're actually going to probably challenge it. Okay, that's going to get overturned. His knee was down. Ball popped out. We're down bad. So the clock is going to run for them. We're in a tough spot. Let's see what they do here. Oh, my God. Fields is... He's too good. He's too good. They're beating us so bad that they had a timeout to use there with one second left and they decided to not use it and it's let the clock run out. What is my speech at halftime? Tell me in the comments because I don't have one. To make matters worse, we're on defense again. So you know what that means. A lot of missed tackles. Ohio State has over 220 rush yards and I think the majority of them are by <laughs> their quarterback. We're trying. I, can I speak to a manager? Hello? Hello? I'm turning into Karen. I've rebranded the channel to Good Game Karen. And I'm out of here. But Good Game, bro, you're not looking like you play at Heisman. Shut up! This is Super Heisman. <laughs> it's a level that only Justin Fields can hit. JoJo! Believe. <sighs> ten more yards might be a touchdown. Well, second and ten, JoJo making an adjustment. At least we can see our receiver icons right now. Oh, Jesus Christ. It doesn't matter. I have an idea. Call to play where everyone goes deep. Jojo Johnson will then run. Oh, they were ready for it. Sir, this is a Wendy's. Jojo Johnson, that's not his fault. He threw a dot to Troy Bradley. He dropped it. If we had... Any remote? Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ. If we had any talent, I would have cut him already, okay? But I can't. The scholarship stays. You know, every week I try to figure out, like, what could I possibly recruit to help us out? This week we're recruiting everything. I I'm talking about everything, okay? <laughs> can we get someone that can tackle? 
Oh, thank you. Thank you. Bro, I'm not joking. Justin Fields is 245 rush yards. He might break the NCAA record for most rush yards in a game. Like, he's not too far. Look at this man. Look at this man. Look at this man. I hate it here. We're trying to key in on Fields, but it just doesn't work. I mean, the dude is electric right now. There's a reason why he's one of the top quarterbacks. Taken! Hammond! We're tired of getting kicked out. Yeah, I'm gonna be honest. They should bench Chris Olave, you know? Might get hurt. We're bringing hammers out here. Oh, I thought Fields was gonna keep it. He's kept it like every time, but he didn't. Another first down, Ohio State. If there's something to like be remotely happy with, it's the fact that we have scored a touchdown. <laughs> That's really about it. Look at that big hit. Let's go. That was a nice hit by Antonio Magwood. First tackle of the game. I just need about 27 more of those with forced fumble recoveries for touchdowns. And then we might be okay to not lose that lead. Trey Sermon literally just killing us right now. Four for him. 300 plus yards given up. He has been in motion. I mean, one on one zone don't matter. There is better. So here we are. Down. <laughs> Tremendous. Right now. We're just trying, you know, anything and everything. That That's not what we should have tried. We're kind of like the school that you schedule on senior day, right? You know, there's a slim chance they could beat you, but it's probably not high. And you're probably going to make them want to shut down their program. I'm thinking about it. Scramble's not there. Honestly, there's not really many plays that are there. We're just we're trying. I mean, where is that throw going? It's not even who we try to throw it to. I'm honestly, we might, <laughs> we might bring JJ Shipley back in the game. And just be like, hey, look, bro, you got to do something, okay? <laughs> you might have to play defense at this rate. Trying to do something here. We've been blitzing a lot. Has it worked? No. Did zone work before that? Also, no, but Chamberlain's out here getting a big hit. 238 yards for Fields. Even when he's getting tackled for losses, man, he's still just proving that we're down tremendous. Guy in motion again. I mean, we got to do literally rubbing shoulders with Justin Fields. I'm crying. I thought about bringing JJ Shipley in, but then I said, why? We're just going to. Okay, this is getting bad. Honestly, I don't care about anything else other than scoring a touchdown here. We got one goal. We're not winning the game. Try to score a touchdown. Jojo. Oh my God, Jojo. <gasps> Progress. Hey, look, I can't front. I thought that pass was going to go about seven yards away from where it was intended and into the hands of an Ohio State player. I really did. Also, I really want to score a touchdown before they put all their bums in, you know, like that would mean a lot <laughs> to score a touchdown against their starters. The second one. What is your vertical? The stats at the end of the game. <laughs> it's going to be painful. Dawkins deep. Downs there. <laughs> That's a big dude running at you. Fourth and 10. We're down tremendous, okay? Fourth quarter is not here. They're calling it questionable. I'm calling it intelligent, you know? I'm calling Jesus Christ. It's Jason Bourne. Who is that? Why is he that fast and that large? I think the worst part about this episode, more so than just getting absolutely beat down, are the little sausage finger murmurs that are going to tell me in the comments. Good game, bro. All you had to do to beat that was do this. I'm telling you right now. Shut up. All jokes aside, though, this is a series that should mean that we lose a lot, right? Winning the game against Michigan was an absolute fluke. I'm happy it happened, but I intend and I hope that we lose a lot and then we eventually get better and make some plays. But for now, we're trash. Ohio State still has Justin Fields on the field. <laughs> I'm crying. I am. These aren't tears of fear. They're tears of anger. <laughs> I don't know. Fields has 291 yards rushing as a quarterback. 
I mean, outside of Vad Lee, I can't think of too many quarterbacks that have run for like that much in a game. Like, it's kind of insane. That was a great hit by Jackson Chamberlain getting in the backfield again. He's finding ways to make plays, and God knows we need him. It's just a couple hundred points too short. Chris Olave's back in the game. I hate it here. I hate it here. The chances of 60 points are now 99.9999999999999%. And they just achieved that goal. <laughs> We're down tremendous. Six minutes to go. We just need seven more points. <laughs> Believe. Why are the starters in? We're just trying, man. We're trying deep passes, short passes. Communicating telepathically. All of it's not here. I have for 17 for Jojo Johnson. Whew. Hey, as the kids say, she, she. Third and three. Oh, Kyron Chris is in showing the Ohio State that they're trash. 65 yards later, in the end zone. Their starters were in. We got it. That was a lame duck that we threw. It don't matter in the scorebooks. We got it. Single digits. See you later. Okay. Good news. They have a backup quarterback and he's in the game. Is he good? Probably. Trey Sermon is still in the game though because he's their backup running back and we honestly were struggling to tackle him. This means though that we can kind of, you know, pad our stats a little bit, at least on offense, maybe get a pick or so here. Stroud is this guy's name. Oh, Jesus Christ. He's got a cannon. Pressing up a little bit. Blitzing the whole squad. Shockley. We did it! Our first interception of the school's history comes up against a backup quarterback from the Ohio State University when we're down a lot. Hey, look, I'm not mad at it. Any, any, any way we can get it, I'm here for it. We're keeping our starters in. We need this right now. Kalen Harris, make it happen. We've kept JoJo in. I mean, he's going to be playing next year, right? Shipley is a senior. We got to just, you know, fight through these bad moments. Oh, God, Troy Bradley. I thought that was going to be Moody. Going to the hurry up offense. JoJo making a couple of adjustments here. Not much of a hurry up offense when you're doing all that, but it is what it is. Oh, my God. I left Troy Bradley wide open. This is how you know the backups are in the game. We're out here. Don't call it a comeback. It's, I mean, it's not. JoJo Johnson, third pass to touchdown of the game. He's got three interceptions. We're still going to be starting J.J. Shipley. We just needed him to take a break, okay? Take a break. Hey, look at this stage. Why would we not go for two? You know? Why would we not go for two? We're going. We're going for reps here. Uh, let's let's cancel that. All right, here we go. Cash money, Chiron, wide open. We're coming back to get some respect. We went for an onside kick and it didn't work. You know? Are you surprised? No. Nothing, nothing really has worked for us today, to be honest. Nesbitt, though, with a big hit. 404 yards rushing is how much we've given up. <laughs> I'm vomiting. This will always be one of those games that we will circle and remember, and it'll be talked about. Hopefully never again in the history. What is Reed Jr. doing? Are, are you drinking? Oh, that wasn't a catch. Great coverage, young man. You know, press coverage. Help us, Tom Cruise. They actually ran it and we stopped them. We're back. Okay, they even their backup punter. It's probably probably their real punter, not their backup punter. Their backup punter or punter. We put our backups in. Everyone's crying. Shepley's gonna get it to Derwin. Derwin, not exactly a speedster, but he's showing off a little bit here. I'll take that 18 yards in the catch. I guess in fairness, we should have kept, you know, our backups in a little bit earlier, but our backups are the backups for the backups of Ohio State. So there's that. And underneath here, Troy Bradley, who's been pretty active today. He's going to pick up 11 more yards. Jordan Damon's in the game. He's actually a corner on our team. One of our starting corners, mind you. YOLO. Oh, Lord. Hello? You know, that kind of gets me thinking, though. Damon is a freshman. He's a corner. Maybe at some point we let him, you know, try to, you know, do some stuff on offense. Just maybe. I mean, he's kind of trying stuff on offense now because we've, you know, don't have a lot of our main guys in. We have our backup quarterback in it. Our backup quarterback's in a receiver right now. We are down 
tremendous. I'm throwing it to him. That's not our backup. Never mind. Chipley's just trying to get some stats and put some respect on his name. Oh, look, Damon's in right now. Let's see what he can kind of do here. I'm going to put Downs on a deep route. He's gassed beyond belief, but let's see what Damon's got in a little slant. Okay, the man's route running's the opposite of good. Could be one of the last plays for us. It's been a struggle. Damon's got speed, if I remember correctly. Send him deep. Let's see if he can beat that corner. He did not. YOLO. No shot that. That was on purpose. Hey, I don't know who number 10 on Ohio State is, but he's definitely getting benched and never playing again. The Ohio State University. They are who we thought they were. Fields had a tremendous day. 125 through the year, 286 on the ground, four total touchdowns. And everyone in our sidelines crying. And they're for all the wrong reasons. Recapping the stats today, it was an interesting one. Jojo Johnson came in, eight for 20, 273 yards, three touchdowns, three interceptions. That is a terrible stat line. The yardage is great, but everything else is abysmal. Chip Lee, five for 14, 104 yards, one touchdown, one pick. Again, not great here. Miller Moody, 16 yards rushing. We'll get him a rushing touchdown, I hope, at some point. We start playing really, really bad competition that we can hopefully win a couple of games against. Joshua Johnson at 8 yards. Troy Bradley at 10. Shipley, we just won't talk about that. In the air, though, Kalen Harris, we did get him a couple of receptions. 3 for 121. Got a touchdown for him, which is great news. Lonnie Downs, 3 for 31. Troy Bradley had a touchdown on a 2 for 56 yards. Damon, again, our freshman corner, came in and did pretty well. He had one grab for 51 yards and one touchdown. That was a fluke, but I'll take it. 18 for Derwin, 65 for Christensen, 15 for Dawkins, and then again, Moody getting involved in the passing game, got 20 from there. Defensively, our guys had a whole lot of opportunities to tackle today. We see Nesbitt go for eight with three tackles for a loss and a sack. Uh, Teddy Edmonds had seven. Jackson Chamberlain hit people hard today. Five tackles, three for a loss and one sack. Again, to recover our, or to cover our sacks, we had two Nesbitt and Chamberlain picks. We had the first one in school history from Zion Shockley. It was the backup quarterback, but it counts, you cowards. Be safe, be smart, tell somebody you love them. Hopefully next game is better.